Welcome to this short video on Qigong for Seniors. In this video, you're gonna learn a few exercises for anti-aging, for health and vitality. You're gonna learn what Qigong is, and I'm gonna show and share with you a little bit about the philosophy of Qigong as it relates to aging. So Qigong was called the art that prevents disease and prolongs life. How's that? That sounds good, doesn't it? The art that prevent problems from arising before they get started. Prevention is key to this medicine. How do we prevent problems from arising? We move our bodies, we breathe deep, and we clear stress. That's what Qigong is all about. Qi means energy, it's your life force. And think of Qi as the electricity, the bioelectricity that flows through you. And when Qi is flowing and circulating through you, the natural result is health and longevity. It's like water that's circulating and flowing. Water that circulates is healthy. Water that doesn't move gets stagnant. stagnant. And the same is true for your body. So we're gonna keep this water of life flowing and circulating, irrigating all the tissues. Now aging in Chinese medicine and in Qigong was revered because as you got older, you got better at your Qigong practice. You cultivated more energy. You got less stress. You became more powerful. That's different than the paradigm that we have in Western culture. So as you age, you become more energetic, you become wiser, you become better at your Qigong practice. Qigong, gong means skill, a skill at working with life. So as we get older, we become more skillful. So the art that prevents disease and prolongs life. Let me show you a couple exercises that are for anti-aging. First one is about enlivening your spine. You know, in, they say that sitting is the new smoking. It's not that we get older and develop all these problems and stiffness and tightness and pain. It's usually that we get older and as we get older, we stop moving our bodies. Now, if you were 20 years old and you stop moving your body, you're gonna develop the same thing, pain, stiffness, tightness. You're gonna feel older before your time. So movement is key. That's why in the West, now the research is saying sitting is the new smoking. Sitting too long isn't good for you. So let me show you some healthy ways to move your body. This one is called spinal cord breathing. You're gonna inhale, nice deep breath, and open your chest, look up. Exhale, round your back, tuck your tailbone under. And inhale, open your chest. Exhale, round your back. Deep breathing is good for you. Deep breathing plus movement is even better. You're enlivening your spine and you're bringing more oxygen into your system. Every cell in your body can soak up that oxygen and turn it into energy. Exhale as you round the back. Inhale, open your chest. Exhale, round the back. Move all the joints in your spine, clear out stiffness, tension, and tightness, and relax. Let me show you an exercise that I learned from a woman in China who was 106 years old and had 10 classes a week that she was teaching at 106. Amazing, right? She was exemplary of of what it means to be vibrant and vital as you age. This is called Swimming Dragon. I want you to stand with a stance that's just a little bit wider. Your hands are here by your chest. You're gonna push your hands over to the left side. I'm gonna do your mirror image. Go over to the left side and you turn your head to the right. And then your hands go to the right, but your head turns left. Now what's happening here is you're massaging the muscles in your upper back and neck and through the rib cage around your internal organs. Get a sense of that movement. Hands go one way, head and neck go the opposite direction. Now let's add another piece to this. Bend your knees. As your hands go to the left, your weight shifts to the left. So weight shift. Then your head turns to the right. Come back to the center. Shift your weight, push your hands and turn your head in the opposite direction. That is called swimming dragon. And now try to make it nice and smooth. Push your hands one way, shift the weight, and turn the head in the opposite direction. Push the hands, shift the weight, turn the head. 
And this is good for your whole body. Feel right through your ribs and your internal organ. It's like there's a gentle massage squeezing through the ribs and the organs. And then your spine, as you turn the head and push the arms, you're invigorating the tendons, muscles, and ligaments right around your spine. And just pump the energy through the body. The breath is just natural. It's full and deep, deep, natural breathing. And you do this for a few minutes to invigorate your energy, improve your circulation, and to cultivate resiliency, that combination of strength and flexibility through your mind and your body. Come back to the center. Relax, walk your feet in, shake it out a little bit. And now let's pull down the heavens. Let's just bring in energy and vitality, health and longevity. Let's bring in those intentions. Let's inhale as the arms come up and exhale as the arms come down. Qigong is the practice of cultivating energy. And there's always an abundance of energy in nature. So tune into that, feel these waves of relaxing energy washing through you. Feel waves of relaxing energy pouring through you from the head to the heart and from the heart to the belly. Waves of relaxation and healing going downward, all the way down through the legs to the feet. Inhale and exhale. Qigong is done slowly with intention. It's mindfulness in motion. So it's an integration between meditation and movement. And this is where the power, the anti-aging benefits come in so strongly in this practice. Inhale, the arms float up. Exhale, your arms float down. Hands come down, down to your sides. Bring your feet a little closer together and just relax. I want you to notice how your body feels after those three exercises. See if you feel a sense of lightness, a buzzing and a tingling with energy. Breathe into that. Relax and shake it out. You see, this practice doesn't even take very long to start to get the benefits. So if you like this practice, click the like button on this page. Also, if you want more videos like this, click the subscribe button to this YouTube channel. We also have a free two week Qigong subscription where you get to participate in my weekly classes. Now these classes, they're an hour long with a 15 minute meditation. Imagine doing that a few times a week how much health, energy, and vitality you can cultivate. Now, if you don't have an hour three times a week, each of those classes, we pare it down into a 20 minute routine. We just take the class and edit it down to 20 minutes. So you can do a 20 minute or an hour or do the full hour and 15 minutes with that meditation. The art that prevents disease and prolongs life. Let's do this together. Let's age gracefully. And I hope to see you in that subscription. Thanks so much for joining.